This doesn't seem so bad. It is zooming out a lot though, which kind of makes me worry a little. Whoa, he's gigantic. This is awesome. Hey everyone, it's Starby from Blue Tumblr Games back with a bonus episode of A Koopa's Revenge. We're gonna try to get the good ending. Let's get started. All right, so last episode we beat the game, we got the bad ending. Now it's time to find the Koopalings and hopefully get the good ending. First things first, we're gonna go to a Switch Palace and we're gonna hit L and R at the same time on the keyboard which will allow us to go back in the Switch Palace. Why are we doing this? Because I've heard the legend of a pink Switch, which is hidden somewhere inside of the Switch Palaces. So from what I've read in some tips, it seems you're supposed to go behind a pipe or something. Maybe you go back in the pipe. Oh, you go through the pipe. Ooh, bonusy bonus area. All right, cool. Congratulations, you found a secret room. Feel good about yourself? That is all. Sweet! Looks like we can get some awesome power-ups with it. Kaboom. Nice. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. And for our second power-up, mushroom. Not as exciting. Now, apparently, there's also another hidden exit in this room, which unlocks the pink switch palace, if we can find it. Nothing there. Maybe it's not in this particular switch palace. All right, let's try the old green switch palace. All right, same thing into the pipe. Back through the pipe. See if we can get some better power-ups, maybe? Now we got lightning Koopa and boom! Bang mushroom again. That's fine. Then we'll, uh, somehow we go up through the wall or something. Let's try the left first. Nothing over there. Maybe it's really tricky to get to. We could try a little like roll action, like <gasps> that worked. Roll action worked. We're going over the green switch. Oh, this is awesome! It's like Metroid. And check out the Koopa Troopa. This must be Tanuki Koopa Troopa. Whoa! You get a Dragon Yoshi statue thing. <laughs> this is amazing. Pink switch. Kaboom! This is the most bonusy episode of any bonusy episode ever to be of a bonusy episode. I'm really liking Pink Dragon Koopa Troopa. All right, so what does this do? It appears that we've awakened the dragon and now the dragon transforms the regular leaves into the Tanuki leaves. I like Tanuki Koopa Troopa a lot. That is so cool. All right, now it's time to go find the Koopalings. So somewhere in this tutorial level, there is a hidden Koopaling. All right, here we go. We're in the tutorial section. All right, we're looking around. Can't go in the pipe. Where would this hidden Koopaling be? Over here? Nothing over there. Star. Star unlocks this. Can't go in there. I'm just trying to guess everything I can. All right, need a veggie. Boom. Just over here, there's an orange pipe right there. I bet we gotta go in that orange pipe, maybe? Maybe we can fly up there? Can't go in the orange pipe. Can we go in this? Ooh, that's it! That's gotta be it! That's gotta be it! I think I saw a hint saying that orange pipes take you to the Koopalings, too. Going up to the top. Um, I'm not really sure. Koopaling Star! One of seven! We rescued one of the Koopalings! Amazing! Alright, so one seven should have the next Koopaling. Should be Mushroom Way. Okay. Alright, now the only hint I have for this one is to take a donut block somewhere and that we might want to have a f the flying ability, which we already do. We actually have double Tanuki right now. We just need to find a mushroom platform. Oh, there's one right there. Boom. Or not a mushroom, but a donut block. <laughs> I don't know why I said mushroom platform. Definitely wanted a donut block. Orange pipe again. Okay, so orange pipes are coupling pipes. And then we gotta fly. Oh, I see, I see. Fly, fly, fly. We can fly for a long time. Coupling star Morton, I think I saw. Awesome. So that's two Koopalings down. 
Nice. Now we must head to 2-4. This is the Angry Moon and Sun level. And we need to figure this out. Alright, so on this one, I think we need to head left. Okay. There's an orange pipe. Oh, two orange pipes. I think we need to go in the quicksand between them. Hopefully. Yep, hidden pipe. Oh, and I bet we need to go in here. Maybe. I don't know, I'm a little nervous about going through there because there's no ground. Oh, yep, it's a Wendy one right there. Oh, we need the spike power up because that's the one that you can go in a straight line. Oh, there's one right here. Perfection! I need to be like. Yeah! That was awesome! All right, three down, four to go. This is going pretty smooth. All right, now three, two, we need to get one. Oh, wait, I remember this one. I think we found this one before, and I needed a power-up that I didn't have to do it. Nope, wrong spot, though. <laughs> Dang it! It was here. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> this looks better. But I think when we were in here, we needed a certain power-up I didn't have at the time. Ooh, what if the blue block gives it to me? Yes, the switch palaces are where it's at! Yep, we saw this before, and we couldn't swim through before, but now we have the Snorkel Koopa. Allows us to swim through. I'd like to make a quick shout out to Slendy Notch, one of my members on BTG that actually left all these hints for me. It's really helping out a ton. So thank you, Slendy Notch. I think that was four Koopalings, three to go. We got this. So I need to find a reddish brown pipe and then run back to the beginning of the level. There's the pipe. So if I go back to the beginning, a brand new pipe should be up here. Which is confusing because I don't think I would have ever guessed this in a million years. And it works! Alright! Alright, Koopa Troopa. Now, what do we gotta do to get this one? I bet the lightning would work fine. Yeah, we're just lightning over, grab the Roy Coin Star, Star Coin, Roy Coin Star, Star Coin thingy. Beautifully done, Koopa Troopa. Mecha Mario, leave me alone. Alright, we got Light Bulb Goomba to do this one. Reach for the sky. I think we need to get into that pipe right there. Somehow. This one's gonna be hard to do. Got it. Into the pipe. Alright. Now let's see if we can figure it out. Activate a platform or two. We're dead. <laughs> Dang it! Big platform. Little platform. I don't know which platform we want to get the coupling. These dang birds that just hop endlessly, always ruining my day. Oh my gosh. Okay, fine. We'll figure this one out somehow. Smash a you. Where's it gonna be? Oh, I see. Ooh, tricky. The orange one's up top. Going under. Get up there. Go through the pipe. It's not over. It is not over. Okay. Hopefully we didn't need those anymore. What's right there? Okay. So I just need to go like this. <laughs> oh, what? Maybe we can do it from here. <gasps> that worked! Woo! Okay, okay, that worked, that worked, that worked. Okay, let's go to 4-4. Four, four. This should be the final Koopaling, if I can find it. All right, this says something about Baby Luigi. All right, so here's Baby Luigi. Probably need the Tanook. Uh, I feel like we've done this before. Ooh, there's a pipe. Oh, orange pipe, that's gotta be it. All right. I just need to break these bricks, easy peasy. We got all the Koopaling medals and super happy bonus area. Dang. Anything we want. So all Koopalings found, we just have to go back, get to the final boss again and see what's different. Let's do it. Whoa. We found a new power up. Boo power up. Cool, I like that. Oh, and it shows me secret paths. All right, cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, we flew over the wall. A little pipe, and... 
Where the heck are we now? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't think I went this way last time. Nice having some flight. I like Dragon Koopa Troopa. Maybe this will be a shortcut. That'd be nice. A little shortcut would be pretty nice. I'm still curious what to do with this Boo power-up. I don't want to lose it because <laughs> it's so awesome. Another... I don't really want that. Oh, it's a one-up. <laughs> I thought it was like a power-up. I didn't want it. Oh, I think that put us all the way to the boss fight. Awesome. So we got Tanuki and we have Ghost. I say we stick with this. I say we stick with this setup. Let's do it. All right, everything we need. All right, we lost the Tanuki instantly. Cool. Please don't kill me. Oh, I know how to pass all those. I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> See you later, Mario. I don't really want to lose my... Oh, come on! Fight number two. Cool. So far, so sloppy. Whatever. We got this, probably. Jump over your head, get the axe, aru. Nice, 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 nice. Over your head, kaboom. Enjoy that, Mario. All right, time for the upstairs fight. Let's use old bone throwing Koopa Troopa. Old Koopa Bones. This is what the boo power up looks like on the Koopa Troopa, I guess. I'm a bone throwing Koopa Troopa. Now I kind of remember how to do this. If we just want to get close to him, he'll try to punch us. And we gotta dodge these. Spikes, he'll try to punch us. Cool. That was a risky maneuver. Cool. I don't think those hurt me. Pretty sure that landed on my head and it didn't hurt me. Maybe that's the beauty of having the dry bones power up. He just can't seem to hurt me. Whoa, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, he hurt me. He hurt me. Can you come back over here? Because you were a lot closer over here. Do I have to start basically completely over? I think I do. Cool. Come punch me. Okay. Smart's not even hard. I really screwed this up. Dang it! All right, big it on, big old Mario. This is just about where I defeated him last time. So what will be different? Let's find out right now. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Boom! Boom! There's the catch up again. There's old Bowser. Little Hugaroo. Is this any different? Oh, this is different. This is awesome! So all the Koopalings we saved are at all the exits. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> How do you like that, Mario? I feel weird being the bad guy. I feel weird having Mario be the bad guy, but it's kind of awesome. All right, Ludwig. Um, so now what? Is this the good ending? Did we do it? But I heard something about an alternate boss battle. Uh-oh. Okay, so we are top of the castle. Final confrontation. Final boss fight! Let's do this! Alright, what do we do? Backup power up, I don't mind that. Two backup power ups, what if I fly? Nothing to fly to. Alright, let's go in the giant doors. This doesn't seem so bad. It is zooming out a lot, though, which kind of makes me worry a little. Whoa! He's gigantic! This is awesome! Whoa, whoa, whoa! He destroyed the floor! What am I supposed to do? All right, here we go. We can figure this out. He's destroying my platforms. He's zapping my platforms. Mario is not happy. Oh my gosh, he punched me in the f face, kind of. Bomb. I think I'm supposed to hit him with the bomb. Oh my gosh. 
Things are not going well for Koopa Troopa. This is awesome, though. Gigantic Giga Super Mega Mario. Mm. Oh, I got him once. Oh, but he's got me a few times. Now I'm naked Koopa Troopa, and I'm dead. <laughs> that was embarrassing. I need that bomb bomb. Ooh, got one hit. Nice. One hit, he's hit me once. So it's even. How many hits does it take to kill a gigantic Mario? I'm hoping like three or five. That seems a little possibly low, but you know, it'd be pretty cool. There we go, two hits on accident. And he's trying to take all my platforms away, which is pretty cool. Whew, it's not easy. All right, shy guy. We can do, oh, that was not smart. I want that though. I smashed the dang thing that I needed to jump on! If we get a chance to get a power-up, it would be great. It's just really, uh, what's the opposite of easy? Oh, that's right, hard. It's really hard to do this. Oh, nice. Oh, I got killed by the pink bomb bomb. Cool! You go for the pink bomb bomb, you die. I mean, I like it. I like how it's just impossible. It's cool. Cool, we're dead. So I get punched in the face again. Cool. How about a power? Oh, cool. That's nice. It's like you just land somewhere, you get zapped, you don't, you fall off. No matter what happens, you die. And that's what I like. Nice. One hit, and we have both power ups still. Full power ups. All right, we lost one. <laughs> we did get one hit, and that's something. I'll take it. Hit him, please. I think I got two hits, maybe. I still got a couple power-ups. I lost one, cool. And I'm in the bad spot. Got one back, cool. I got three hits. Is that it? Was it that easy? Yes! <laughs> I mean, it wasn't that easy because it took me a lot of tries. Three hits and he's dead? Oh, we can smash him into the ground. Rip, you big fat jerk. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, we did it. We beat Mario. We got the final boss fight and the good ending, I guess. But we only have 91% of the game completed. All right, I'm going into... Wait, what am I now? Why am I like weird Koopa Troopa now? Am I indestructible now? I think I'm indestructible now. Maybe I just unlocked the ability to not be hurt. Do I have cheats? Yeah, we unlocked God Mode. You're immune to all forms of damage. Nice! That makes my life a whole lot easier. All right, so we have 91% of the game cleared. We need to find the hidden exits. Let's do this. All right, so the first exit is in World 1-1. Let's find it. Cool thing is we have the ghost power up and we have invulnerability to everything. So now it's all about hunting. Not so much about dying. I feel like I've earned the right to use the cheat. So this wants me to go in here, I think. Into the old underground. Ooh, wait, see the ghost up there? He's telling me there's something up above. Oh, the ghost power up's so useful. There we go. Up three moon. We can't fall in pits anymore because we're indestructible. Secret exit, boom! Beautiful! One secret exit down. Gives us a pipe. Pipe takes us to World 2. Awesome! You could have skipped all of World 1 from the get-go. Saving game, boom. 92%, okay. We got more to find. All right, supposedly there's one in 1-5. One Let's do it. Let's go into the D.O. Nut Bridge. Donut Bridge! All right, secret exit needs to be somewhere. Ooh! There's a hint from our boo buddy. Looks like we have to go under the flagpole. That's working. Ooh, that's a sneaky one. Sweet, sweet baby 100. Nice job, Koopa Troopa. Scary boo Koopa. <laughs> Ooh, another pipe. Takes us over to world two. Nice. Uh, puts it up to 93. Oh my gosh. The Goomba becomes Friday the 13th Jason. That's awesome. I love it. 
I want out axes. This is so cool. All right, I honestly had to look this one up because I couldn't figure it out. But yeah, who would have ever saw that boo there? He was so low. You have to go under the flagpole. I gotta be honest, I didn't figure this one out on my own. The boo just wasn't up high enough to help me. But we still got it. I had to cheat on that one. I'm not afraid to admit it. Don't hate me. All right, cool. Another one down. All right, all right, all right. All right, 2-1 supposedly has an exit. Let's see if we can find it. Did we ever go up the vine? I can't remember. Let's try it. The vine could be the way. You never know. Could the vine be the way? I don't want to die. Please be the right way, vine. Doodly -doodly -doodly. I bet we've already did that exit. I guess we'll find out. We didn't! That was an alternate exit! Sweet! Save game, boom! Let's switch over to the Goomba. Oh my gosh, Scary Goomba looks awesome! Alright, supposedly there's one in two, three. Let's see if we can find it. I bet we can find this dang old hidden exit. Let's just tell me to go in the store, so we're gonna do it! I'm really liking Ghost to Goomba. He's <laughs> just really cool looking. Door. Oh, it shows you where the hidden doors are. That's pretty cool. <gasps> There's a hidden door right there! Come on, I love that we can just bounce on invisible stuff. Oh, double boost! Don't mind if I do. But what do we do now? Do I go in the door? I'm going in the door. Oh, there's a key! Give me the key! Oh, we don't have any way to fly. Well, that's not good. Maybe we can get on top of the... Ooh! Top of the house will work. I was gonna try to get on top of the window. Pick up the key, go to the keyhole, boom! Definitely didn't get that secret exit before. Special world! What? You gonna tell me that there's a whole level we've never even played before? This is awesome! I love it! Maybe we should turn the cheats off. Since it's a level we haven't beaten before. Plus I want to see how awesome Goomba Jason looks! He looks so cool! I love it! Oh wait! Oh, we can pick literally any power-up we want! This is amazing! Alright, well I definitely want a boo. Now we can be Scary Jason or Regular Jason. And a star, nice! That's so cool! It's like a top secret area! Now that is awesome. Let's get out of here. Alright, next one is in the Angry Sun level. Let's do it. I think we've never went left. Here. Should we try going left? This can't be right. Alright, this seems right. <laughs> Even though I just said it couldn't be right. Okay, this has got to be a different exit. I don't remember doing this, but it's been a while since I've played some of these levels. So it's kind of hard to say. I love this Jason Goomba. This might be my favorite. It sucks it took me to the bonus episode to find it. But we found it. Cool. Boom! I love it. Alright, that gives us a blue pipe, which takes us over to Retro. Zero one Retro! Another new level! Alright, turn the cheats off. No god mode. Change to the flower face. To the Mario flower, <laughs> sure. Yeah, Boo Goomba. This is just 1-1. One, one. Yeah, I love the Mario fire flower. That's cool. 1-1 one, one remade in a Koopa's Revenge 2. How awesome. I wonder if there'll be like some big twist at some point. We gotta see if the bonusy bonus is there. Oh, you can't scroll left like in the original Mario on this level. That's pretty awesome. So we shouldn't be, yeah, look at that. We can't go left. That's so cool! I love it. Such cool little details to this game. Their ghost is pointing right into the door. Ooh! I think there might be another secret! We gotta go back. I think right here is where we're gonna need to fly. There we go. Bowser coin. We can go into the castle gives us another alternate exit. I love that some of these secrets have secrets in the secrets. That's pretty secrety. 
What the heck? <laughs> That's so awesome. So that could take you all the way to the final castle way early in the game. All right, we need to save our game. 100%, we got them all? Is 100% the most you can get? All right, so I thought I was done, <laughs> but we didn't get these three cheats. We gotta find them. Let's do it. All right, one cheat should be in one six. All right, my hint for this one is to throw Mecha Mario at a block near the door. Probably means these yellow blocks. No, it was that block. Awesome! <laughs> it's not one of those Metroid rooms. Space jump get. Use the space bar to jump continually in the air. Jump while pressing the left and right key to perform a spinning jump. Yeah! That's awesome! Oh, I see. So you can jump continuously in the air. That's pretty cool. All right, cool. We got it, though. Because it's 101%. There's more than 100%. All right, all right, all right. We had to head over to 4-5. Okay. And riding up one of these 16 ton things gives me a secret room. And that's the one. We got lucky. We'll take it. I've been looking around in here, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. We can go back up the way we came, but that probably isn't right. Wait, whoa! Well, this seems good. Lightning flower. Tanuki flower. I guess we'll stick with Tanuki and, and Ghost Goomba. All right, now what's the deal with all this? There's two shining down here. Maybe we'll blow up the ones that are shining like a shell. Kaboom. And it gave me a vine. We need a way through there, and we don't have one, because we don't have the right power up. Dang it! Blow up. Yes. There, we got it! Screw attack! Yes! Use the screw attack to defeat enemies and become temporarily invulnerable. Jump while pressing left or right. Key to perform screw attack. Turn off screw attack on the pause screen. Sweet! We got the screw attack! That's awesome! Alright, exit to map. Save game, boom, 102. How do we know if we've got 100% of this game or not? All right, there's another cheat in two, three, which I think's the ghost level. I think we go through the first door. Oh, you can kill booze with the screw attack. That's pretty sweet. Go through the first door and then Go through where the first door was again. And then what? <laughs> Ooh, that worked. Ooh, I'm so glad we have God mode on. Yeah, I definitely haven't been over here before. Whoa, this is awesome. It's like a Mega Man level. I love it. I mean, it is a Mega Man level, but a Mega Man level and a Koopa's Revenge just is so cool. I missed so many awesome things. Rush Coil. Press the R key to summon Rush to give you a boosted jump. I don't think I have that mapped to my controller. Boom. Rush Coil. That's awesome. <laughs> I love it. That is so cool. Wow. That's awesome. <laughs> I was not expecting a Mega Man level. Wow, 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 wow. We have 103% now. All right, I now know that there's 106% is the final save. So there's probably three hidden exits we haven't gotten yet. All right, note at this point, I read some false information that there's 106% to be a complete playthrough. But I did find out after I recorded this episode that there's actually 107% from the maker of the game, Lamb Taco. So ignore the 106%, eventually I figure this out. Let's get back to the game. All right, there's one in four, three I haven't done yet, so let's try that. Okay. Supposedly somewhere around here is a key. Oh, right there. Easy peasy key. I just gotta take the key to the end. I think I remember this level, because I saw a keyhole and I had no idea where the key was. Thanks to the internet, I now know where the key is. But how do I get the key out of here? It's a little tricky. 
Whoa, I'm so glad we have on God Mode. I almost forgot to turn it back on. Okay, that makes it a lot easier. This would be a lot harder to do without the cheats, obviously. Okay, where's this keyhole at the very end, right? Boom! Wow, okay, we're so much closer to having 100, 100, 100 percent. All right, we need 2% more. Dang, we're so close. There might be one more in 4-1 I haven't done yet. So I thought we did everything for this section already. Must be something we are missing, though. Something up here, maybe? Mm. Oh. Don't want that. I like the power-ups I already have. Thank you so kindly. How do I... Can I go over this wall or something? Yep. Going over the wall. Did I get this exit last time? I don't think so. I think this is different. Man, I'm so glad we have God mode on. Hey Yoshi, what's up, man? The Luigi exit, cool. I mean, we have one hidden exit we haven't found yet. Yes. Oh my gosh, one left. All right, all right, all right. I think I found it, I think I found it. The final thing we need to get 100% was actually in 1-4. We've got Indestructible Darth Goomba. I had to look on the internet and really, really search for this one. because I couldn't figure out which one I missed, so I just kept comparing my map to other maps I saw online. And it turns out I was super close to this exit earlier. So once we're up in the clouds, we need to start this. And then we just need to stay with this platform. That's going to be the whole key. Once we're on it, instead of falling those three coins down like you really, really think you should, you just keep going. Boom, that should be 106%. I think we finally got everything. 96, yep, we did it. We cleared the entire game. Boom, 106%, awesome. <laughs> All right, so sadly, I found out that there's actually 107% to finish the game, but I know where the last percentage is, and we can finally complete a Koopa's Revenge 2. Let's do this. I have God Mode on still. Kick baby Mario in the face. All right, so I needed that mushroom right there. I believe, I actually watched the creator of the game do this. You bounce up here. You jump into the lava, which you wouldn't think you would want to do. You grab this moon if you want. But here's where the ultimate secret lies. I would never have known this if I wouldn't have watched Lamb Taco stream the updated version of this game. You go through here, jump over, there's an imaginary floor here too. And then you get the infinite up shroom. What a game over. And that, my friends, should be 107%. Let's find out. Here we go! As you can see here, we finally did it. 107% playthrough. All right, what an amazing game. This was so much fun. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel and you like what you see, be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you'll know when I release new videos. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, join the BTG Discord, check out my merch store, all down in the description below. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, I'll see you around.